All right, I should be alive. Hey guys, what is going on? I'm Kings, and today we're playing some new games that came out for PlayStation Plus. Bioshock The Collection, which has, I think, Bioshock 1, 2, and Infinite. And then there's also Sims 4, so I thought I would give these games a shot and see uh, if they're worth you guys, you know, downloading them. Alright, let me share my social medias real quick. <clears throat> Good Alright, so I've never played Bioshock 1, 2, or Infinite, so this is going to be a first for me. Um, I played a little bit of Sims 2 back in the day on PlayStation 2, so it's been a long time since I played a Sims game, so it's going to be pretty much fresh experience for me. Are you playing Rainbow? Does it look like I'm playing Rainbow? Rainbow? <laughs> like, Rainbow 6, uh, it's pretty obvious that I'm not playing Rainbow, bro. <laughs> Fucking sweater's all messed up right now. I need to situate so I can game for a long period of time. There we go. Okay, I wanted you to play Siege. Uh, you gotta give me your input on uh, Discord, man. I pretty much went through and asked Discord. Like, one person that wanted me to play Siege, and other people, other people wanted me to do a couple other games, and I was like, you know, I downloaded these games last night. Thought maybe I'd give them a shot, maybe show you guys if there might be something that you might be interested in playing. My idea. <clears throat> well, we can always play Siege later. But, you know, I play these games and don't like them, and you know, I recommend that you don't play them. You know, that's something I could do. We can see how it goes. All right, 2K made Bioshock. You know that. <laughs> well, the Bioshock series was just something I was never really interested in back in when they originally came out. Now, were they remastered, and that's why they were put into the collection, or were they just left alone and just put into one single disc? Wonder what happened. I, my, my guess is since it's probably like tried to do one, Charter did, and probably remastered. It'd be really weird if they did remaster it. I was put on the default mode. You know the 9 out of 10 ladies prefer the athletic man? Advertisement, sport, boost, genetic tonic. What do I get one of those? Nineteen sixty, mid Atlantic. They told me. Son, you're special. You were born to do great things. Okay. You know what? They were right. Why did it seem like they were all yelling before things started going down? It's like they knew. Yeah, that'd be really scary if that ever happened in real life. Alright, cool. I get to control the camera now. And move. Alright. A little sluggish. The controls are a little sluggish. I'm not sure which way we're supposed to go. Do I have options? This one's control sensitivity. Let's boost it up a little bit. 
Yep. I don't think that changed anything. It went up, but yet it didn't feel like it changed. It still feels as sluggish as it was earlier. Art subtitles, dialogue subtitles, we'll leave that on for you guys. Mm. Okay, it feels a little bit faster now. I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. I guess it's through the fire. <laughs> hey, Purgatory, how's it going, man? Is this always there? Just look away from the look at the chat, and then this uh, power just shows up. I guess we'll head over there. Hey, Purgatory, Bioshock 2, Bioshock 1. I'm playing Bioshock 1. I'm going to try to play the PS Plus games and then show how much the stream what they're about and stuff like that. So we'll get on Sims a little bit later. Uh, just to play that game for the stream. Probably just two hours of this, two hours of Sims, and then we'll uh, see what's up. You're telling me I'm the only one who survived and no one else tried to make it over there? Is that tail actually going down? I think it is. Slowly. Okay, let's go inside. Hey, Dark Matter, how's it going, man? It's from PS3, so it's going to be sluggish. Yeah, I, I, I feel that already. Hey. No gods or kings, only man. Okay. In what country is there a place for people like me, Andrew Ryan? I don't know who that is. I think the architecture's a little gaudy, but that's just me. I guess we're on a loading screen now? I am Andrew Ryan, and I'm here to ask you a question. Is a man not entitled to the sweat of his brow? No, says the man in Washington, it belongs to the poor. No, says the man in the Vatican, it belongs to God. No, says the man in Moscow. It belongs to everyone. I rejected those answers. Instead, I chose something different. I chose the impossible. I chose rapture. I chose rapture? What does that mean? A city where the artist would not fear the censor. Where the scientists would not be bound by petty morality. Where the great would not be constrained There's a time traveler that went through the Bermuda Triangle, they say? Are you telling me what's going on with this game? What's going on there? The gas fishy? I don't think the biggest issue would actually go in here. I love how there's buildings on this side and there's buildings on this side. It's like there's no travel in between, so why is it built like that? If there was a city under underwater, like everything would be connected through like tunnels that people could walk through. Oh, another loading screen. Alright, it's gonna tell me actually how to play the video game. Alright. Fire weapon is R2. Fire plasmid. L L2 and R2. Is both weapon firing? There's no aiming? 
which weapon is R1? I didn't, yeah, I didn't get to finish reading it. Hey, that, that went too fast. I couldn't even see that one. That's not good. Oh, who Andrew was. Okay. Rapture is in the Bible. Guy comes to every one other world. Just judgment day. Okay. Why is he getting killed? Yeah, you got something on your face, buddy. He needs to go to anger management. Kind of gave up. Shortwave radio. Oh, this? I don't know how you survived that plane crash, but I've never been one to question Providence. I'm Atlas, and I aim to keep you alive. <laughs> Why? You say so, but there's a crazy lady who just killed some gutty in front of me. We're gonna need to draw her out of hiding, but you're gonna have to trust me. I'll wrap you in a sheet. I'm stuck on those boxes there for a second. Just a bit bored. Why would you get super close to her? Now, would you kindly find a crowbar or something? Bloody splicer sealed Johnny M before they... Crowbar? Goddamn splicers. You're the kind of mercy, M. You're the dog. You're the little beauty, M. Find a crowbar. I don't see no crowbar. Okay. Don't. I can't see anything. It's so dark in here. Oh, did these boxes just randomly? Okay, I can't. Are these boxes in front of me now just magically out of nowhere? Okay. Lovers says find a weapon. I don't see any weapons. What the hell is it talking about? Is there a crouch? Oh, here it is. This isn't a crowbar, this is a wrench. You lied to me. You lied to me. I'm good looking. Can't they see that? What the hell is he talking about? How do I go through here? Oh. Oh, I won't. Just crouch. Is there a block? Circle to heal, okay. Is there a, uh... Where's the controls? Where's the controls? Um... Hmm. Interesting. All right. Uh, plasmix is of that direction. Make sure I don't miss anything because there was something just randomly sitting on that table. Ooh, pet bar, potato chips. 
Oh, your health just goes up by just eating it as you pick it up. You don't actually get it for, uh... Like, get, keep as inventory. Okay. Well, I wouldn't have picked it up then if I knew that. But thanks, video game. What this does? Let's just stab myself with it. Just see what happens. Does that make any sense? Would anybody in reality actually stab himself with that? <laughs> you know what? I'm getting electrocuted. I mean, you know what I want to do? I want to jump over this ledge. That's like a great idea. This little fish looks like he just had his cherry popped. Wonder if he's still got some atom on him. Some atoms. I'm guessing that's like. Weak. You're a weak chopper. This little fish, I'm worth telling it with nothing that yellow always have been. We'll be no better off with a metal daddy, little fish. See you floating from my feet. Look, Mr. Bubbles, it's an angel. I can see light coming from his belly. Wait a minute. He's still breathing. It's all right. I know he'll be an angel soon. Um... I don't know what to say to that. You all right, boy? Do I look all right? Fist full of lightning. That means either either or. I can use both. Mm. Hey, I want to pull it out, but it's L2 to fire it. Mm. Thanks, a little strange. This looks like it's all broken. Can't break that. At times. All right. So, where am I going then? Am I going back down there? I'm going through here, maybe. Ooh. Fancy. Oh man, there's something in there. Well, I'm out of my electricity thing, Jig. Now. I do that. Thanks a lot. Hmm. I love how that thing magically like caught speed and like came down and ran here. Ooh, first aid kit. No idea what that is, but I just collected it. All right. One two punch. Got it. What's this? If you are killed by hostile denizens of Rapture, you will be revived, alive, and whole at. Asked by the chamber you passed. Oh, so it's a revive system. Okay, I was like, what the hell is this? <laughs> Let's hit it a couple times, see what happens. Hey, Maria, how's it going? Are you the only one? Yeah, if it's not Rainbow, don't watch us. Just how it is. I didn't mean to hurt anyone. Yeah, you still hit me? I 
found her now. Come back. I didn't mean anything by it. I'm wasting electricity if I don't have to. Wish it was like a quick dodge or a quick roll or something along those lines, but it doesn't seem like there is. So like, when they swing, you can't really do anything. You can't block just to take the hit. game is this? It's called Bioshock. Um, it's free for PlayStation Plus members right now. It's a uh, Bioshock collection. It has a uh, Bioshock 1, 2, and Infinite on it. So I thought I was going to give uh, these games a shot just to see what's uh, going on. These uh, new games, see if they might be worth uh, people downloading. Who knows? Yeah, it looks like that's what happened. Huh. What? <laughs> My guy's not uh, feeling good. <laughs> I don't know what they go to. All freaking out. Can't see anything. How is he in there? The fuck? Anybody else see that? I saw something in that little, little tunnel thingy. You gonna go try it? Cool, man. Hope you like it. I'm having uh, okay time. It's a little confusing. You know, it feels old. But, uh,. Yeah, I know the air is telling me where to go. I'm just kind of like exploring, trying to get all the items on the ground. Careful now. Would you kindly lower that weapon for a minute? What is this little girl doing? I don't look good. You're fucked, bro. Ooh. 
That's gruesome. I think he's dead, bro. I think I think he's. Huh. Is there an inventory system like a like certain like a weight I can carry? <sighs> save your game. Oh, these are one of the games back in the day where you actually could manually save your game. Mm. It's been a long time to play one of these. Usually the game just auto saves and you never worry about it anymore. <laughs> yeah, that guy's definitely ripped. Kind of looks like Batman or something. Um, Batman. Yeah, it's like supposed to be like the '60s. A lot of Batman type of architecture was kind of built around that. Kind of has that like that gaudy, extra like out there kind of look. Ooh, that guy had some food on him. So this is where I'll respawn if I die. Okay, so far so good. Another one over there. That sucks that everyone you run into is a bad guy. Trophy! Toaster in the tub. The player has shocked an enemy in water. 88% of the people have this. Okay. Play the game without dying is what this one is. That's pretty interesting. When, how long does electricity last for? Okay, that long. Okay. So, they managed to kill a big daddy somehow. Interesting. So they're not impossible to kill. She was strong, yeah. She had a lot of damage, but I knew if I would have backed off from her, uh, she would have just hit me with that pistol and probably would have done a ton of damage. That's why I wanted to stay up on her, so she was only just hitting me. I didn't go that way. Huh. Ooh, what is this? Bandages. Oh, free health back. I'll take it. I still have uh, some health potions. That's not good. Search these bodies, but I don't know what's happening. I'm not a bad person. Head to medical. This way. I guess I could have searched those bodies if I really wanted to, but I'm not sure if they were gonna enemies keep dropping down or not, but it doesn't really matter. Oh Christ! You're trapped! Gonna try to override the exit from here! 
I guess enemies are gonna ambush me while I'm in here, huh? So tell me, friend, which one of the bitches said to you the KGB wolf or the CIA jackal? Neither? Rapture isn't some sunken ship for you to plunder. And Handle Ryan isn't a giddy social light to be slapped around. Fearful male wolf, hunter vampire, I'm a GTA 5 role player, okay? So what's this game about? I don't know. So far I'm a guy that was on a plane who just randomly crashed and then now found this weird tower that leads to the weird basement thing and now I'm trying to get out. That's what I've experienced so far. Can you open the door now? Okay. I'm in the medical pavilion now. So hopefully there's some decent medical supplies in here? I don't know. Hey Chris, how's it going man? Hey, more people! I know, right? I don't know, I think my uh, watch number thingy is broken because it says I still have zero people watching, but yeah, you guys are chatting in the, in the you know, live chat, so it's a little strange why the number's not working. Alright, let's get it saved real quick. Welcome. Oh, complete welcome. Alright, I got another trophy. What it is, it's find out. Player success completed the welcome to Rapture. I'm guessing that was like the tutorial area, so everything's gonna get a lot harder from here. <laughs> okay. Now you've met Andrew Ryan, the bloody king of Rapture. Now find your way to emergency access. Well, I can purchase items. I feel like I'm purchasing a lot of bullets. How much is a bullet? Six bullets for 25 bucks. Okay. Check the map and get hints. Oh, I have a map now, guys. We're in the foyer. There's no zoom function in this game. Alright, so... Um... What am I supposed to do? Near the entrance to the medical pavilion, use the emergency bathysphere to reach the Neptune's bounty. Alright, where's the medical pavilion at? It doesn't give me names on this thing. <laughs> I guess let's just go in and just hope. Bot shut down, you invent. Gathers garden and health station. Just the rounds. Alright. Okay, so my pistol's fully loaded. Looks fully loaded. Okay. We'll go up here to chat again. Does it have multiplayer? No, it does not. Not that I've experienced. Uh, at least the first game doesn't. Oh, I'm not sure if the second game or the third game do. I just want to get in here. She didn't want to I don't care where she <laughs> This is where I want to go. Let me go in here. Hack security bots are friendly and will attack your enemies. Find pipe segments by revealing hidden tiles. Pick up pipes and swap them with other pipes to create a connected line. Add the flow of metallic liquid to the exit pipe. This new circuit will rewrite their machine's desired effects. Look okay, at time limit? Swap the pieces to divert the flow of green the green goal. Complete the hack. Avoid alarms and overloads. If the end flows at any point other than the goal or end, the machine will short circuit. Okay. I don't know what I'm looking for, to be honest. Oh, okay. 
okay, I see how it is. Where's the end goal at? I don't know where the end goal's at. down here. Okay. Need a straight pipe. And I need another straight pipe. Straight pipe. Got it. I was first kind of confused in how this was work supposed to work, but I figured it out. Oh, we got another trophy. Two trophies. The players perform at least one successful hack. I see. I'm not a moron. I figure things out with my brain. I'm just that good. Map is the way there's narrow. Scaring me. Keep away from my can, you, can you deal with this? Get with this, little bot. I say lead. Oh, lead head. Okay. I was like, lead, huh? What the heck is it talking about? The little thing following me around is a little weird. Get out of here. Oh, nothing in there. What does this do? I don't know. I don't know what that's doing. Why is this covered in water? Do I have to uh, turn it on somehow? No shit, it's not safe, lady. <laughs> I'm trying to loot bodies here to get some more ammo. This is the Vita Chimney store I came from. Well, apparently, I don't have SMG ammo. Guessing that's different. 
Nothing in the handbag. So I'm gonna need some machine gun rounds soon. Should I switch over to a pistol? Mm, I don't know. I'm not sure what I'm gonna need. I don't know if I like, oh, should I save this for like a boss fight or something? I don't know. Be better if there was aiming. I know. I was like, why can't I hit this guy from a distance? Yeah, always pick up the shiny. That's what I find out when I play video games. That was scary. Above all, do not harm. Follow the blood, he says. Huh. Oh, he had no SMG ammo. I thought he had maybe some SMG on him, ammo on him or something. Still haven't run into a big daddy yet. I need some monies. Oh, I'm out of ammo. <laughs> awesome. Okay. That was weird. Yeah. Did oh, she just get freaking health? Crazy lady. Ammo vending machine offers a variety of ammunition for sale. Most ammo vending machines have limited selection or of rare advanced ammo types. A successful hack will reduce the prices of real ammunition. Okay. We give it a hack. Oh, this looks relatively difficult. Hey, you don't know what the heck this thing's talking about. Okay. Buckshot, I don't have anything to do that with. Lost half my health trying to hack that thing, which isn't good. It seems like everyone in here has a freaking pistol. Buckshot. It'd be nice to get a gun that could actually use that buckshot. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just kind of messing around right now.
ten dollars. Was it worth it? I don't know. So we call it Big Daddy. Yeah. No. Uh, the big uh, the big guys with the drills on their arms. Those are the big daddies. Did I loot you guys' bodies yet? Yeah. Okay. What? what was that? Alright, I am here. I need to go... Over there. Where's the goal? What the? Crazy man. There's an invisible wall here. I can clearly jump this, but I can't go up there though. Guy okay, likes to ride in fucking blood, for sure. Ooh, coffee. Oh, I'm here, okay. Crematorium. I guess we can go and figure out what's up in the crematorium. Can't go up that way because it was blocked up by an invisible wall. Security cameras. I can hear the infernal things all around you. Ryan's eyes and ears. What happens when I'm spotted by the security camera? I don't think anything happened. Special ammo. Pick the right ammo for the right enemy. Armor piercing rounds. Okay. I don't know what that means, but sure. I like there's another camera up here. Is somebody there? I'm opening you up! I thought maybe like the electricity was gonna do actual damage to him, but it didn't seem like to do any real damage to him. Hmm, interesting. There's still a lot about this game I still don't know. Kind of figuring it out as I play, I guess. Ooh, new plasma incinerate. Incineration when you absolutely positively have to erupt in flames. Don't wait, incinerate. Set objects and creatures on fire. Repeated to use to increase the pain. Ages 12 and up. I can use it! Stronger bullets? I think it's for, like, heavy armored enemies. Probably, like, for, like, big daddies and stuff like that, would my guess, but... I'm not sure. They didn't say. You gotta use it for the right enemy, and I just don't know what's the right enemy and what's not. Well, I guess we'll have to find out while we play. Oh, that was, oh, that was oil on the ground, not water, so I like, just like caught everybody on fire. That makes sense. Uh huh. I wait for the fire to go out so I can actually get the hell out of here. Fire gonna go out at some point?
By the time this game's over, I feel like I'm gonna end up killing everyone that lives here. There's no one here anymore, just, everyone's dead. Alright, so this goes up to where we were just at. So, I guess that's this area complete. Let's save it. Just in case, like, the game crashes or something it happens. Yeah, it might be good on Big Daddy. That's all I was thinking. Alright, so we got this area completed here. Right? That's this area. You go up the steps and then you're here. It says there's more steps. Was there really more steps over this way? I don't see any steps. I see these steps over here. Oh yeah, there's just steps that go back down. Okay, that's all it is. I was a little confused it did. So yeah, back here now. And now we need to go that direction. Back where we came from. Hopefully the enemies haven't respawned. Why do I feel like they respawned? What is this? Is this frost? Maybe if I use this, it'll melt. Interesting. Sucks there's no blocking feature in this game, you just have to take the hits. <clears throat> Chris, how do you rate the game so far? 1 out of 10? Um, if I had to rate the game as I played it right here, right now, there's a lot of features that I think there should have been in the game, like a block or maybe a quick dodge. Um, story, I don't know about much about the story. It feels kind of like uh, Arkham Asylum is where you're kind of stuck in the asylum and you're trying to get your way out. Um, I don't know. I think I'd give it uh, probably 6 out of 10 right now. Seems interesting. Um, definitely some game I could probably finish and play and beat. So it's not one of those games I would be like, oh, I'd, I'd probably never play this again after the stream's over. I probably would probably end up playing this and finishing it. I'm not sure if you guys would be interested in me actually finishing the game or not, but maybe. Never know. Unknown enemy. A little scary. Let's shoot him. Oh, okay. Ooh, what's this? Ooh. New engineering tonic security expert. A new offering in the Hack Smart Line security expert has designed for the hackers specializing in disabling electronic and security measures. You won't be secure without security. Uh huh. You pick up your first engineering tonic. Engineering tonics make you better at hacking or using machines. They are equipped separately from plasmids and other types of tonics. Okay. Alright. Hey, 
the vipers was coming, those lights went out, and I was said like, hell no, I know, right, that's why I switched out my, uh, my, I was like, okay, if someone's, some stronger's gonna be back this way, I'm gonna get my fucking best weapon out, you know? Apparently not, though. Like, watch me get out here, and then he's gonna be in that main hallway, and he's gonna be, Aah! I'm gonna leave my gun on. What? I knew you, I knew it, I called it, I called it. I knew it. I just walked to the wrong spot. <laughs> Alright, let's save it. Always save it, guys. When you play these type of games, save often. Hey, Jonathan Palmer, how's it going? I want to see the big daddy. I know, I want to see the big daddy, too. I, I'm guessing they're like the big baddies. Alright, so, I need to go that direction. Did I search this entire area? Hey, don't mind if I just kill you, right lady? Yeah, now you can join your lover. You're welcome. Oh, I can't pick up any of these. Uh, how do I get this? X. Okay. Or square, alright. Square? Now I can pick this up. There we go. Zero, four, five, one. What does that mean? Ooh, cream-filled cake. Well, that's cream-filled cake. In my coffin. Oh, we can enter the code. It is zero, zero, four, five, one. Zero, four, five, one. Ha ha! Using my big brain, boys. Oh, we get new shoes. Automatic hack tool. Okay, I can hack something. Hey, look, you shoot him in the face, they just die. Armor piercing rounds. Don't need armor piercing rounds. Shoot him in the face. Get my siege school, my siege, siege skills. What does it say? Adam denies us any excuse for not being beautiful. Right. I'll stick to Apex. Yeah, you stick to your battle royales. You do that. I've been this way, right? Bag of potatoes just would give you a small amount of health. Why would I want a small amount of health for four bucks? I know. I think I should save it just to get some more of this. The good stuff. Probably electrocute this. This will probably lead me up in here. I don't really need to go there though. I need to go over there to the goal. Why is there storage boxes with nothing in them? What is the point? Please explain. You bastard! That hurt! Why'd you do that? Who just throws a cart at somebody? Come on. Seriously, who does that? Fruit kick was that? Someone is shooting a rocket launcher up in this joint. Let's electrocute it.
Who shoots thought you freaking freaking rocket launchers in a freaking small enclosed area? RPG turret with nothing in it. That'd be worth it. What'd this say? Anti-personnel auto rounds. Huh. I don't know what that does, but okay. Just a weeb. Yo, R6 new graphics look dope. Looks... I don't know. This is a really nice update for R6. I agree with that. Take care of our pistol ammo, my man. Yeah, I, see, I have a lot of buckshot that I don't have the actual shotgun for, so why... Did I miss a shotgun somewhere in the past and it's just, like... I don't know. I used to fight a rocket. I don't know. <laughs> I went down to like half health, so I probably if I would have shot, shot twice with it, I probably would have died. Yeah, if you guys are liking the stream, it really does help me out. If you guys hit that like button and subscribe, it really does help out. Wrench Jockey bulks you up your upper body, allowing you to wield club-like weapons with unprecedented skill and power. Alright, Comic Tonic makes you better at dealing and resisting damage. I like being able to resist damage. Thank you. Gotta go through here again. I just one-tap this chick... Why does she get a flashlight and I don't? I want the flashlight. Gotta dodge that security camera. Oh, this looks like it's gonna be difficult. Ooh, I got an auto hack. <laughs> Cheated! <laughs> okay. Worth it. The player has successfully hacked a safe. I'm at 7%. Trophies. And I've only been playing for. How long have we been playing for? 37 minutes? An hour and 4 minutes, okay. It's 527 for me, yeah. Yeah, I'm on Eastern Standard Time. Alright, four piercing armor bullets, ten buckshots, and some machine gun rounds. Okay. I can buy it out. What I want to do that. enemies and sending security bots after them. Oh, that's what happens when you get spotted. A security bot comes after you. Okay. Interesting. Oh, uh, let's refill. Let me figure out how to get over there. Wait. I went automatically here, right? Did I even go over this way? 
Oh look, shotgun. I got a shotgun, bro. You gonna come after me? I got a shotgun. Come on, buddy. Turn the lights back on. Thank you. So when there's a lot of enemies, the game wants you to take out the shotgun. Okay. I can do that. At least I got the shotgun out. Wait, the shotgun only can carry full bullets? Okay. Interesting. At least I have the shotgun now. That's something, right? Dandy Dental. Head chips, cigarettes. Don't know what cigarettes do. Alright, Maria, you have to work? Alright, catch you later. Thank you for hanging out. And K Lop has followed you. Hey, K Lop, hey, thank you for following me, man. Appreciate it. But yeah, if you want a game that you can just like play single player and like just mess with and have fun, I think this is definitely a game. Oops. Yeah, I fucked up. Jesus. I picked the wrong one. I hate how that you like lose half your health in that. Oh, come on, let me switch. Can't find the right thing in Jake for that. I don't want to waste my thing on it. For like maybe some ammo. I love how it says it's like easy. I can get it I can do it one more time for um too low health. I'll do it one more time. I find the right I'm not Okay. Probably just missing it. The right one. No trophies. New plasmic tech. Telekinesis. Pick up big stuff with your mind. Throw them at your enemies, and what else do you need to know? You have run out of slots and will have to replace the plasma. You can buy more slots at a gatherer's garden. Replaced plasmas can be re equipped at a gene bank. So I can't replace them on the go, I have to replace them now. Hmm. The fire one I'm gonna need to get past some of these obstacles that are frozen, so I need to keep that one. Electrical one's only really good for stopping a uh, large amount of enemies in water, or stopping like a rocket launcher droid. So should I replace it for something that allows me to Pull objects at people. We're holding objects as a shield or grappling objects out of reach. Alright, what do you guys think? Should I switch the electrical one out for it? <clears throat> Anybody in the chat have a any thoughts? You think I should, Chris? Okay. Chris, I, I think you're the one actually watching. Alright, let's do it. Throw objects at foes. You can even catch grenades and throw them back. <laughs> catch grenades and throw them back. My guess is that's the primary purpose for this, so I'm gonna run into a bunch of grenade throwers here soon. You can have, you can catch grenades or tennis balls because difference. I guess this thing's gonna start throwing grenades at me here in a second. Oh. Uh, I wonder if there's something over there. No, 
Okay, I thought maybe like I was supposed to catch him like while I'm walking up here. Hey, bro. Oh. Did I get that one tonic and now I can just one shot like, a lot of these crappy enemies? Even though already. All right, I think I've explored most of this. Besides down here, maybe. Yeah, I think all the grayed out areas stuff I haven't been to. So there's actually technically a spot right there. I haven't been to. This is the area with the shotgun, right? Yeah. This is locked off for some reason. Have I been here already? I think I have. Huh. I'm back over that way, so yeah. It's kinda hard to figure out which, like, direction I'm actually going. Painless dental. Okay, guess the store's not gonna open for me. I still go down that way. Open up! I guess armor piercing helps kill those things. So, I guess that's good to know. We need a Chomper's Dental Officer Key. I don't know what that means. Oh, maybe I can use my telekinesis power to open this. I just wasted armor piercing rounds for no reason. <laughs> hmm. Maybe I can jump up and then just crouch through? Hey. Gotta think outside the box. Gun turret. Gun turret ammo? Hey, Mr. Din, how's it going? King's Rainbow? Uh, no, we're doing uh, this game, and then we're going to play Sims a little bit later, so we can show the stream uh, the new games for PlayStation Plus users. Yeah, it does that. It completely covers my screen. I can't see anything. New engineering. Speedy Hacker. The most powerful, popular... X smart line speedy hacker buys you the time you need to hack any electronic device time is on your side with speedy hacker okay and yeah, just put it there I covered my screen and shit fucking scare the crap out of me bro don't just stand behind somebody like that i just killed you god what was wrong with people you know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna cover the entire room with smoke and then i'm gonna stand right behind the guy with a big wrench in his hand sense. Where the hell did he come from, anyway? Oh, she lived through a hit. Impressive. Alright, pick up a... I thought pistols would maybe do something else, but no, I pick, just gives you extra ammo if you pick up a pistol. Did you see when I opened up the thing, it like the drawer came out and my guy was standing on the drawer, so I kind of like boosted him up. <laughs> Fine. Hello? That's the way I came, so I still need to go down this direction. Oh, there's just the fighter chairman down here. Alright, so we clear out this section, so let's save it real quick.
Can you play? Can I play Sims with you? I don't know. Can you? Is it a multiplayer game? I don't know. If if you can do it, then yeah, I don't see why not. I don't have any problems with that. All right, we need how to figure out how to get the heck out of this. Wait. Did I go here? Yeah, this is what I did first. My God, this guy's taking a shit on heads. Yeah, bastard. Stop that. I wonder if this is gonna re get all like uh iced up if I don't come back here this way. I haven't been that way yet. Unless I have. I don't know. You have to download it? Yeah, it's on PlayStation Plus. And and Big Daddy, okay. Can't go that way, there was locked. I wonder if that means I have to kill that Big Daddy at some point. I never fought Big Daddy, so I don't know. Anesthetics are moral imperative. Why do we have two eyes? Is there some law that says we must tomorrow, Mr. Day, Mr. Years? But I feel like I need this. We're not finished. We're not finished. We'll have to find some way to get through to surgery and stun and steinman. Chin up now. The Lord ain't the quitter. I can hear that splicer sounding off like it's the fourth of July. Explosives are hard to come by down here. Get your hands on some of them bombs he's tossing. Things like that could help you turn the table, but are clear a path. Bombs. Can't buy any bombs. <laughs> what do I hear a guy? He sounds so fucking loud. Why have they come back and go a different direction? I'm pretty sure I don't see any- I don't remember seeing you running any bombs. Maybe over there in that section I must have missed? Hmm. So this leads to there. I guess I could have killed him by doing it one more time. Let's just finish him off. Are you though? Now you're dead. <laughs> Saving content. Always use more ammo. I took a lot of bullets. Anti personnel auto round. Only five of those.
Electric buckshot? Use my armor piercing rounds for that. Static Discharge. Ryan Industries introduces the latest in wartime deterrent genetics. Or gen yeah, genetics, yeah, I don't know what I'm talking about. Static Discharge makes you a walking Tesla coil, zapping anything and everything foolish enough to strike you. You'll safe be safe with Static Discharge. <clears throat> Excuse me. Can't hurt to have it just equipped, I guess. There's never anything in this. down please curve that goes down curve that goes down there we go all right now we need straight pipes more straight pipes lots of straight pipes oops one more straight pipe then we should be good i guess no straight pipes huh Those connect? I think they would. I'm not sure why they're not connecting. I'm confused. I'm ready to electrocute now, thanks, game. I don't have any more straight pipes. I guess I used too many straight pipes. I should have used more of these like curvy thingies, but yeah. There's another straight pipe right here. I could have done it. It's not. Oh shit! Yeah, there's nothing I can do. sucks. It upsets me. Oh, it explodes and kill damages me? I just lost a shit ton of health for fucking no reason! Lost. Uh, fuck to my health. What the hell? Why are they just continuously coming? I don't understand. There's the boss guy down there. Can I damage him from here? On his head. What can I do with this one, Aphrodite? She won't stay still. I want to make them beautiful, 
Mm, shotgun ammo is never a good sign. And I just any excuse for being beautiful. doing uh, appropriate uh, damage. Oh, he died. Okay. <laughs> I, I was like, okay, let me get some anti-personnel get bullets and see if that damages him. Alright. Apparently I defeated the guy without even knowing I defeated the guy. Apparently, like, he stays in the fire if you just put it on fire. It's just a little strange. That was a little weird boss battle. I lost more damage from those bots than I did this guy. Emergency access key, all this stuff. You all right? It was time somebody took care of that sick bastard. Make sure you get the key off, Stoyman. And head back to emergency access. I'm working my way to the back side of Port Neptune myself. We'll get there soon enough. Did you say get a diamond? What do you mean get a diamond? I got that one without getting electrocuted, so it's always a plus. Hey, full health. Take it. Um, let's skim this back to being full. At least I find another one of those things. Uh, let's leave it on fire for now. All right, I think that's it for this place. We can now get the fruit cake out of here. Uh, we killed the boss. Got all the stuff out of here. Let's save it. Always save. Is this a family friendly stream? It can be. Sometimes it is. Sometimes it's not. I try to keep it as positive and easy going as possible. Sometimes it doesn't really work out. That's why he gave you anti-personnel bullets when you kill the boss. You can kill these guys. It's a little one. Here's your chance to get some Adam. Hey, isn't there a trophy for not doing it though? And it's like the good ending is if you don't actually take any Adam. How the heck do I get out of here?
you who will be shot next. Easy now, Doctor. He's just looking for a wee bit of Adam. Just enough to get by. I'll not have him hurt my little ones. It's okay, lad. That's not a child. Not anymore, eh? Dr. Tenenbaum saw to that. Bitte, do not hurt her. Have you no heart? Aye, that's a pretty sermon coming from the Gulu. Cooked up them creatures in the first place. <laughs> Took fine little girls and turned them into bats, didn't you? Listen to me, boy. You won't survive without the Adam those. So what should I do? Should I take him or should I try to go for the trophy not using it? Nice catch. I will make it to be worth your while. Somehow. I feel like I don't want to do it. I don't know, that's my feelings. Dude, I need to go to sleep because I have school tomorrow. Can you stream the game tomorrow also? This game, um, I don't know. I don't know if my Rainbow Six Siege community will be, like, up in arms if I don't do Siege, like, every other day at least. Like, they, they can play when I do Siege every freaking day. So if I do it, like, two days in a row, no Siege, you're like, no, world's ending. Why are you not playing Siege, Godly? It's because no one in my thing besides, like, one person in my Discord said do it. So I was like, we'll do something else. Hey, Hidden, haven't seen you forever, bro. How's it going, man? <clears throat> What did she hand me again? There's something back here, I just can't even access it. How do I go with, how do I get, how, what? I understand, why can I? I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do. Am I supposed to just go and talk to her? I don't know, we can save it and see what happens. Or did I save it already? Director's commentary, little sisters in this level. There's two. There's one there. There's one somewhere else. How the heck do I go? Choose whether to rescue the little sister or harvest her. If you harvest her, you get maximum atom to spend on plasmids, but she will not survive the process. If you rescue her, you get less atom, but Tenenbaum has promised to make it worth your while. Hmm. You playing Bioshock, right? Yeah, I'm playing Bioshock, and then later we'll do uh, Sims 4. Once I hit, like, uh, maybe like two hours, three hours, we'll, we'll do Sims. Wanted to siege so later, let's do rank. <laughs> I guess I have to go to her and then just choose harvest to rescue. I guess no, we'll rescue her. No, no, no. Why is this rescuing me? You saved me. What I don't understand is like I literally just turned her back into an actual little girl. Enraged target, causing it to attack someone other than you. Increase your maximum Eve. Eighty bucks. Health upgrade. Increase your maximum health. Oh, is this saying how much atom I have? Where's my max? Where's my atom count at? Do I have an atom count? I don't see it anywhere. Your maximum health has been increased, allowing you to take more hits without being sent to the resurrection. And now I have zero. Okay. Now that we've done that, let's save it. The Sims is going to be so boarding, is it? I don't know. 
possible. We can always, uh, like, I, like I said, I wanted to make this like a uh, live stream to show people what the game is like and see if they uh, might want to play the game themselves and try it out. Like I said, it's free. Oh, I don't have, I have too much health. Okay. What is the greatest lie ever created? Um, remember correctly, there was another one down that direction, but don't we want to go all the way back that way? Ooh, I think maybe the shock buck probably would have actually done the most. It seemed like whenever he got shocked, he started going like this. So I'm not sure if that would have actually done anything. I don't know. Your hands? It's like Clash of Clans. What is? Oh, Sims, okay. Hey, Wolf Snipes, how's it going, man? On phone, it's, like, really terrible. I just want to wait because they do stuff and it takes time. Oh, we're talking about... Yeah, because you're you're technically not playing a single character. You're playing, I think, like, a, a group of characters, and you're, you're trying to get them to, like, live. I think that's what it is. Like, it's been a long time since i played Sims. I wonder, can I push this? Thought I'd give it a shot. Right. Electric buckshot? Costs a lot. 
Do I want more pistol rounds? Can't hurt. I have a lot of money. That actually damaged me. Here we go. There's nothing in the grenade box. Then why does it exist? Security alert reactivated. Thank you for your patience. I don't know how you managed it, but you did. Come through to port now. I'm looking forward to shaking your hand. Right. So I guess that's the first area for um Bioshock. You want V-Bucks sins? <laughs> so you gonna do arc soon or no? Uh we can like I really just go based on what my uh my Discord wants, and not a lot of people want me to get on Arc. And if I do Arc, like we've done pretty much most of the stuff besides like beat a boss, and that's about it. So I've beaten the first area, so I guess it's a good like section to kind of like stop and then like maybe switch over to Sims, as like. I think this is a good, just like kind of viewing, like we fought a big daddy, we've played the game primarily, so we can show pretty much people how the game plays. But yeah, I would recommend people getting this Delling. It's a pretty good single player experience so far that I've, that I've played. So I'll probably play it offline. Um, probably beat it, probably do that for all of them. But I'm not sure if you guys want me to continue playing these games offline or not. But uh, yeah, let's switch over to Sims and give this game a shot. <clears throat> yeah, the Sims 4? Nice. I'm actually going to change over my uh, categories over to Sims 4. And all my thingies, so. Bioshock, switch over to Sims 4. I love how this is taking so long to load. There it goes. Alright, so that's... Twitch. Now we're gonna go over to Mixer. Alright. Cool. Everything should be in order now. If it gets bad, could you do Siege? If it gets bad. What do you mean it gets bad? Like, no one watching? No one's really been watching so far. So it doesn't really matter if it gets bad or not. I'm just going to play a game and have fun. If you really want to get off, man, you know what to do. Oh, I gotta accept a user agreement to play a video game? Okay. What, do we want half walls? Where do we find them? In build mode. Half walls, like, bird person shooter half walls? Okay. Tiny living, discover university, realm of magic. I don't know what this is asking for. Webcam's blocking a lot of the things. Alright, The Sims 4 Discovery University not owned. Oh, so these are all DLCs the game wants me to buy. Hey, you should buy all this stuff. I'm guessing it's gonna take me to like, uh. <laughs> I like how they're just using Sims language, which makes no sense. Alright, 
a lot for dirt five. She be lured off a bond shot. She go pissin' for the dip of very noise out. Give some this a very noise out. See my flippin'. Climb over clouds in the crippin'. Jive bull as I bit for minting. This is so weird. Wonder how much it is. Let's find out. Probably won't bring a PlayStation. Is it? No. Okay, whatever. Let's just play the video game. I don't want to learn more. I want to play it. How do I play it? Oh. Okay. Are you new to The Sims 4? Uh. Sure. We're new to The Sims 4. We can use some tutorials for some help. One of the things I do in Sims is trap people in pools and then die. Welcome to Create a Sim. This is where your story right. and characters begin. <laughs> Look around and experiment. Select the buttons on the top to give your Sim a name. Boobies! Looks are important. Select the Sim to choose their clothing, hair, skin tone, makeup, body shape, and more. Create yourself, I don't know what this is doing. Know, or even a celebrity. Oh, it's making them fatter. Okay. Make more buff. Who is your sim? What will they accomplish? First, choose an aspiration, which is a life goal. Select one of the buttons on the left of the screen. Undo Zell 2. Yeah, how do I make not a female? I'm trying to get down to the bottom thing, Maj, but won't let me get to the bottom thing, Maj. Like, I don't understand. Like how do I use the top left or go up to the top right? I don't understand. Rotate sim view controls. Yeah, but when I do that, it also makes things go up and down. Change categories L1. Tackle outfit. Categories. I don't know what this is talking about. Cycle category. What? Anybody else completely confused? Why isn't this intuitive? Anyway, hey, things aren't intuitive. Oh, just like alpha redo, confirm back. Okay, here we go. I don't know what this is doing. Rainick? Yes, Rainick. How did you know? Brash, warm, clear. Oh, at first thought that said limited. I was like, oh, that don't make sense. Right. Right. Oops, that's not what I wanted. Jesus. Give him King's Gaming. Pick an aspiration. Okay. What do we want him to be, guys? We want uh, an athlete, chef, painter, trend center. I'm going to wait, guys. That's our. Have a good stream. All right, see you later, guys. I have some expansions, cats and dogs, and vampires and seasons. How much are the, the the DLCs? Are they expensive? How do I go back to changing what my character looks like? I don't understand. There it goes. Ah! Yeah! Is there default? Just default look? Yes, it's default. I guess my skin color is like bright white. 
<laughs> Tattoos, nah. I want to change his hairstyle. How do I do that? There we go. Alright, so here's the short haircuts. A little longer than what my haircut is, but most of these are longer than what my haircut is. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Facial hair, beards, goatees. Obviously, he has to have a goatee. I wish mine got that thick. It really does. Oh, we want a hat. There are no hats. No hats to be had in this whole game. Top expenses are $40 and the ones below are $20 or less. You want me to be chef cook? Okay. We can do chef cook. You want me to, uh, rainbow? I'll just create my character while I'll wait for you guys to come up with the... with the decision. I gotta need to wear sunglasses while we're in inside. Just glasses. I want sunglasses. Give me sunglasses. Um, what? Why did his hair go back to that? Please explain to me the logic that that, that does not apply. I want just black sunglasses. Is it too hard? I'm really an aviator's guy. Is, is, like, getting sunglasses, like, impossible? Is that what's going on? Yeah, apparently it's, it's too difficult. But I'm not sure why it went back to default hair. I don't understand. I have to go back into the hair selection again. Find out what I put on for hair. This one, right? That looks way cooler than me. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we're gonna change clothing, right? Is there any hoodies? There we go. No results. Of course not, that'd be crazy. It's just weird, my guy just go shirtless for no reason. I don't really care. I just wanna wanna get started. I wanna start playing. No pants! Oh, it's because it's stuck as filters. See look, it's changing my guy's hair again. I don't understand. Why is it doing that? Anybody does anybody know why it's doing that? It's no rainbow? Yeah, no rainbow. You have to go to each individual uh, like filter up here, and then make sure his hair is normal is normal on every single filter. So I have to go through every single every single clothing design for my character and make sure his hair is the same way. That's fucking annoying. Like that's that's literally really annoying. <laughs> Cargo pants always. I need to go back up to his hair option again because. Reasons. I don't know why it makes me change this every time for every single filter. It's trying to push me off a little bit. Make sure all of them say the same thing. Okay. Is he wearing leather pants? Who in the right mind wears leather pants? Never, ever wear leather pants. What's wrong with you? 
Cargo pants, always. Doesn't matter the situation. And wearing a gay jacket. No offense, people wear these type of jackets. Oh, gay. Yeah, can I have like no jacket, please? Is, it, is that a possibility? Yes, take the whole shirt. Yeah, Jesus. Good enough. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. How do I start this thing? Your shoes are a little funky looking, but... Alright, let's get this started. Alright, so we wanted me to be a chef, right? Alright, trendsetter, chef. There we go. Alright, foodie. Perfectionist. Oh, so I can't change... No, I can't. These are all part of just chef. Wait, why, why can I click these? I'm confused. Okay. Well, I don't. I don't care. Let's let's start. I want to. I want to start it. I want to play the game. Let's see what goes on. Oh, you're in your sleep outfit. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why. Like, the guy kept changing the hair for the guy for every single outfit I was I was wearing. I was like, that don't make sense. My hair doesn't magically change. Hey, Terry Ghostly, you were clicking on preset avatars. Was that really? Yeah, I don't know how this game works. I'm still confused. Oh, my guy has regular glasses on too. I actually used to wear glasses back when I was like young. Welcome to The Sims 4. We can't wait to show you all the wild stories you can tell in this game of life. I don't want to have a housemate. Can I kick him out? That's something I can do? I don't understand. Why? This is weird. Can I move the camera? Okay, there we go. Alright. So, we need to greet this... Alex. Wait, I'm living with a... The female. It's not gonna be awkward. Your sim should follow Alex inside the house. Select Alex's portrait and press the R3 button to have the camera follow her. Then select anywhere on the ground and select go here. Two adolescent adults of different genders. Select their portrait to find them. Mm-hmm. But what was I supposed to do? I wasn't paying attention. Sims have basic needs. Okay. Right now, your sim is hungry. But don't worry, Alex will prepare a meal for your sim. Snibara Watanini. Hanaklets. You always get preview your sim's needs such as hunger or social by the color of the diamond indicator above them. Sim, if it goes to green to red, look for its needs panel. You'll need to know how to control the camera so you can see the things you want to see. Use the right stick to control the camera. Try it now. Oh, I can try it now. Pictures. Pictures, what? I'm confused. What the heck did she just mean by pictures? Seventeen dollars. Get your happy ass. What? How do I make him move? Get your happy ass in there. You the graphics. <laughs> What do you mean? This is this is this is the this is Sims 4. It just it came out like three years ago. Select objects to give directions to your sim. For example, select the delicious food prepared by Alex and tell your sim to grab a serving. Ah, okay. Who eats at the dinner table anymore? Let's be honest. Like, come on, does anyone still eat at the dinner table? Relationships are very important to Sims both for their stories and their social needs. Select Alex and then select Get to Know to see your sim start a conversation. Feel free to experiment with friendship or romance to tell the stories that interest you. Hmm. Should we romance Alex? What do you guys think? What game are you playing after The Sims? Um, I don't know. I'll probably end up getting off. Yanira Cebu, a Wimbo. Who's that? The Yaza. Only three years ago, not bad at all. <laughs> Shift your gaze to the top of the screen. You've been playing for a year, Wolf. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna need you for pretty much. Sims need money my to pay bills, knowledge of how to play this game. household items, and even purchase food. Luckily, we had Alex pull a few strings to get your sim a sweet job, which starts tomorrow. You can choose a different job later if you don't like this one. You always have choices to make for your sims. Hey, Miyudo. 
Prepare food, mix drinks, not started. Daily task. This isn't dishwasher. It works tomorrow. Fifteen dollars an hour. That's pretty good for doing dishes. Okay. How do I get this off my screen? Oh, circle. Okay. Alright, now what? Do I fast forward? I forget, how, how do I see his needs? Something about Oprah? Do I fast forward? Oh, what's going on? No, R6 Customs is annoying. Ten dollars to get off this game and go to R6 Customs. Okay, sure. You know me, I'll do anything for money. I don't know. But if I had to, like, judge the game based on what I've played currently, which is, like, nothing, like, there's a, a really big learning curve. Interact with fun object. What's a fun object? What does he mean by, like, I can't activate this? <laughs> I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Lord Plash. My guy's gonna watch TV <laughs> while we're talking. Has learned the following traits. Foodie. Okay. Go to sleep for the night. Say what about the thing. See, I don't understand. I don't. I don't know what to do. <clears throat> Wolf, help me out, bro. What am I supposed to do now? Why did this guy just walk in? Yeah, I just like walked in. I didn't. I didn't ask you to come in. I thought my guy was gonna go up and go answer the door. I'm confused. I don't know what to do. Everything's disabled by the by the. Do a weather turn. Current lot. Disabled, disabled. Trade slob. Alright, Ephraim has donated $10 to for me to get off the game. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm a little confused on how to get my character to do things. So... Is there like a save option? I'll save it here and try it later because I'm confused. But yeah, I guess that's going to be it for the stream. Uh, it'll take me about five minutes to switch over to Rainbow. Um, so yeah, guys. Uh, quick thoughts on the two games. This game's a little bit of a learning curve to it. Sims 4. It's uh, not a bad game. Once you probably figure out all the mechanics and how to get games to, the game to actually function. Um, it's, not, it's not bad, but learning curve is there. Bioshock, you can just kind of jump in, and the game will just pretty much tell you what you need to do as you're playing it. Um, I think Bioshock is definitely a must must pick up if you've never played it before. Definitely recommend picking up that. You get three games out of it, so there's no reason not to get it. Um, but yeah, so 
Generally get Bioshock, Sims 4, if you're up for the learning curve, get it as well. These are, it's probably like the best month I've seen for PlayStation Plus games, so I wanted to check them out. Uh, usually there's like one game that's like worthwhile picking up and other games that just aren't. So, yeah, good month for February for PlayStation Plus games, but definitely recommend you guys at least checking these games out. They're free. Um, Bioshock is a decent chunk of gigabytes on your storage drive, so that is another thing you guys have to think about as well. It's like 60 gigabytes, something like that. So, yeah, so make sure you have enough storage space when you're downloading the game. I didn't have enough storage. I had to delete like four games just to get Bioshock because it was like three games in one. <clears throat> but I hope you guys like this stream. I'm going to switch over to Rainbow. It's going to take me about five minutes. But yeah, hit that like button and subscribe. Follow me from Twitter, Facebook, uh, Twitch, and uh, Mixer. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.